Hey folks, Grumpy Blogger coming at you on this bright sunny 35 degree day here in Muskogee, Oklahoma. The next to the last day of 2019 and this decade. I had frost on the window and all that good stuff this morning. But hey, my window's clear. Yeah, I think I'm going to permanently mount this up here today. Because I really like having this sitting here. It, uh, camera's kind of tilted towards me. And but as I was saying in the earlier video, before I stopped at the store there, I'm having problems been having some problems with several pieces of software and this is the reason I went back to, I went to an iPad for everything is because you guys saw last week how my show went I think that was related to zoom I don't know if they fixed that they just did an update on vmix and I don't know if they fixed the problem so we'll find out today but also, I added uh, uh, Iola System Mechanics uh, with live antivirus, and it just screwed up everything. It, it sets itself, starts running during programs when you don't want it to. Something's happened to my mail program because of it. So, uh... I decided to go back with what came with the system. I just renewed it for another year. And it's the uh, McAfee Life Safe. I've had good luck with McAfee since when I use it. I'm just going to quit using that other stuff. And it covers every machine in my family, including my phones, either an iOS or an Android phones. So, all machines in my house are covered. So, that's good. I'll, uh, I'll add that to Judy's machine, and that should help clean up a lot of that stuff. But hers is running good, actually. She did hers did an update yesterday that was, you know, went her yeah, did an update that sometime in the last couple of days. It's running tickety boo. Do not ask me where I came up with that name. I heard somebody say it somewhere. You know, and God, I, I've used it for years, but I quit using it for, you know, that's another thing that I talk about on my, the silliness of my show, is, uh, where do, where do we get these phrases, you know? Like, I can think, you know, when you're trying to find the name of that one particular part that goes on your car, but you just don't know how to describe it, you call it, you know, the whatchamacallit. Or a thingamabob. Or one of my favorites, a chingadaris. Now, where did that name come from? Chingadaris. I've used that word all my life, you know. And run along, pickety boo, where'd that come from? It's just one of my silly observations when I'm up before before most humans should be allowed to be up. I mean God, it's not even nine o'clock and I'm up. Of course, my friggin' appointment's for 9 o'clock. And Judy's been killing me. She's, I mean, I, I think it's great, don't get me wrong, I love it. But she's getting up at a decent hour. And not just sitting up in bed, she's getting up, getting a robe on, getting dressed, and, you know, like yesterday, she's been all day sitting in her chair, in her electric chair, watching TV in the bedroom. She came out the day before, she came out in the kitchen on Saturday. And by the time, the day was over, I was tuckered out. You know, so, uh, uh, not tuckered out, there's another one. I think that refers, it actually means somebody who's really hungry, you know, because to tuck means to, to eat, you know. And, uh, I also want to uh, defend uh, Greg from Oz by Drone. Uh, when Ken Heron and Kelly, you know, use the old, he uses the word patent, and uh, 
then they, you know, how do you spell it? P-A-T-E-N-T. Patent, you know, which is patent, the way we say it. Because the name P-A-T, it just says Pat, not Pate. And uh, which I'm sure my son will appreciate it because his name is Patrick, so he'd have been called, you know, Patrick all these years. But anyways, I digress. I was listening to a, we listened to these uh, Miss Fisher Mysteries, Murder Mysteries, on uh, out of the BBC or something. And uh, there's that noisy truck up there. But anyways, they were talking about pants, and they used the word Peyton, okay, so that's used on their television, so because I asked them, I said, we can sure call Peyton, because I guess I always have. So, at least it's not just Greg that says it wrong, it, or says it differently than we do, but all of Australia, apparently Melbourne. Hey folks, I know you could have watched other videos and I want to thank you for watching mine. So, always be nice to each other and don't forget. Okay? Alright, you have a good one. I'm out of here. Bye bye for now.